been hiding out for a while and he's here tonight to talk about all his future work, his, his past work or whatever. We have Donald White. So, Don. Thank you so much. How are you? Hi, Donald. How are you? Fine, thank you. Thank you for finally coming to the show. Oh, after a long time, yeah. Now, listen, what brought you out of the woodwork? Um, a guy that works on your show, actually, like, you know, he came to my house <laughs> and he was going to beat me up. Actually, Frankie D'Augusto uh, does yeah. sound for the show. He used to work with Peter Frampton back in the 70s. Yeah, he came to my house and he was threatening me. Like, I said, whoa, 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 whoa. It's a bit on the cold side. Like, come upstairs. Let's go and have a talk on the kitchen table. <laughs> so he came upstairs and he's giving me... I said, Hang it. whoa, you've got the wrong guy. The guy you want lives next door. <laughs> so now listen, when so, did you... I'm sorry to cut you off. When did you actually realise you had talent in painting? Uh... Years and years ago, like, you know, it, it's one of them things you, you, have, you, you've either got it or you haven't got it, like, you know, and I started, I was working out in the Middle East, and you get terribly, terribly bored out there, like, you know, and uh, I used to go out in the desert and just, you know, just paint a little bit, like, you know, in between times of, you know, working, because I was an iron worker out there, like, you know, and uh, a lot of people said, you should frame those. I said, oh, why? He said, they're good, oh. Well, I didn't, you know, I always play myself down, everything that I do. But um, I, went to, I went to college for about six months. Mm -hmm. And uh, a guy that I met there, he was an absolute whack job. I mean, a, a complete <laughs> whack. He was, he taught, and it turned out to be Ian Anderson. From Jethro Tull. From Jethro Tull, like, you know, and he, this particular day, we had to go outside and he said, we've got to go out sketching. He said, you don't come with me. Now, he's, he's a couple of years older than me, and it starts raining. So he decides to take us in a pub. <laughs> now, I'm, on, I'm underage. It's, all right, come on, you're all right. No, no. So uh, we've been in there for about an hour then, and he says to me, we've got to do something. You know, we've got to do something before we go back. I said, what are we going to do? It's raining. He said, pick something in here. Pick a subject in here. Mm -hmm. And there was an old guy warming himself by the fire. Long matted hair, like you know, looking like a real good looking. A guy. real, yeah, oh, a real <laughs> picture he was, like you know. And we'd seen him; he's getting himself plied about, you know, with it, with, with the beer and the and the spirits there. And he decides to get up, and he's wobbling a bit. So we said, follow him. So we have outhouses out in, in those days, like you know, we don't have the bathrooms like you have over here. And it was like a stone slab outside. Mm -hmm. So this guy goes outside, like you know, and. Um, Ian shouts over to him, Oi! And this guy turns around, he, he gives it that look. And that's what I did. Wow. Let's get a close-up oh, cool. of this. Now, was that actually for one of the album covers, or was no, that No, no, no. Actually, the, Ian painted that. I didn't. I did the sketch work for it all. Uh-huh. And um, he says to me, he said, can I have that? He said, well, we went back to school, like, you know, and he said to me, can I have that? Mm -hmm. Take it if you want it. About ten years later, that's the album cover for Aqualung. That's dynamite. You know, and that was that was that's, that's my a only very famous album cover. <laughs> that was my... and, uh... Now let me interrupt you for a second. You got the accent. Yes. Uh, wait, what, you want to take a guess? I don't um, know. British. Oh. Ireland. Irish. No. I'm, I'm the worst. Well, you said pub, so. Pub. Yeah. Well, so so it's Scott English, isn't English. it? English. English. Okay. Oh, it is, isn't it? It is, it oh, is. Sorry. Yeah. Do you want to go have a bubble? <laughs> you can go have so a bubble. So you're originally from England? England, yes, from Manchester. Okay, cool. You know. <laughs> That's a good thing. So now listen, what subjects did you actually like to paint and sketch before you started dabbling with the other uh, stuff? I, I, I like doing animals a lot, like, you know, but there again, though, anything that really takes my fancy, like, you know, that, uh, that comes up. Uh -huh. And uh, I did this one here. Is a boatman. This one was crossing one of the uh, rivers in the Middle East, like, you know, and then that's how they are. Oh, yeah? <laughs> it's, uh, you know, it was a dow before they put the sails on it, like, you know. Now, how long will it usually take you to paint something like this? It just depends. It, t it depends on whether I'm really interested in doing it. If I'm do interested in doing it, It'll take me about 25 minutes. If I'm not, it'll take me two years. You know, I know, I hear you. Oh, wow. It's like anything <laughs> you know. else. So... What else you got? Oh, we've got another one here. We've got to make it like a slideshow. Yeah, well, this one is... 
This one is uh, is a, a, a sketch oh, that I did nice. of a that's nice a lion's head. Wow. Can you see this? Now, how close were you to him when you painted? <laughs> it uh, wasn't close, uh, was it? it? Actually, it was. Um, it was one of those you, you 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 take a photograph in your mind's eye about okay. this, like you know. Okay. Since since lately though, what I've done is um, I've started taking photographs and then doing a picture of them after, like you know. Now this one is an industrial scene that I did, you know, just before I left England, like you know. That was the. But that's again, that's that's another. It's a made-up one, like you know, because. You don't get too many of these close together like that. Like, That's you like know. a Pink Floyd album cover. <laughs> yeah, it would be, yeah, if, uh, All right, cool. if ever we got that I like one. the black and white. Very yeah. cool, sharp. Now, are these originals? Or yeah, or yeah, these yeah. Are, yeah, these are all what I've done at home, like, you know. And this one, you see, nobody ever paints divers, mm -hmm. you know, underwater. So I just got it into my head, like, you know, I need to do something like that. So if yeah. you have a look at that one after, you'll see. What it's like. It's I'm good. taking this one home. Oh. <laughs> All right, thanks. Oh, that's gorgeous. <laughs> and uh, this one here, me and my uh, son, we was in Disney World and we was walking through a gallery and we seen this picture with a big sun on it. And uh, Adam says to me, Daddy said, that'll look cool, that. Can you do something like that? About two years later, this is what I came up with, like, you know, and everybody likes that one. I don't right. know why, but everybody likes that one. Have a look I'll at get it. A Let me see. Now, do, do you ever want to, oh, or did beautiful. you ever do any uh, art exhibits or down in... No, no, no. no. I, I, it's... Awesome. It's a thing that, you know, like, I, I get a bit embarrassed with them, like, you hey, know. I represent you giving them. Well, you kind of answered my question. I was going to ask you if you went to art school and where well, you Well, I, I did do for about six months, that, like... When Ian left, he went down to the uh, London School of Economics and okay. that's where he met Mick Jagger and all the rest of the guys down there. Uh, we kept in contact for, you know, about two or three years after, like, you know, for, uh, 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 you know, and that's about it, like, you know, but um, he's been over here a couple of times while I've been living over here. Okay. We never got into contact, but I, I, I keep telling him I'll go down, like, you know, but, right. you know, he's got his career, I've got mine. <laughs> Did you ever meet Mick Jagger? No. No, no, I, I, I met his brother, Philip, like, you know, but I never met him. How's he? He's just the same. Nut? Nut job. <laughs> yeah. He's airing a lot of dirty laundry on me No, he is. <laughs> Philip's a real whack job, he is, like, you know. God. I didn't even know he had a brother, Philip. Oh, yeah. He's, um... He's big in, um... Economics, he's, uh, he's Philip. You know, he looks after... A lot of the things that the Rolling Stones are doing, like, you know, the album label and all that, like, you know. I hear you. So... Well, we've got time for one more question. Yeah, I just wanted to ask you, how did you end in America? What made you get out of here? Why'd you leave us? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, 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 was, I was working in the Middle East, and they sent me over to... Well, they said to me, like, you're going back to the old man. I said, I'm not going... I said, I've been, I said, I've been out here now for 13 years. I said, give me a break. So then they, they said, OK, then. So they sent me to the Bahamas. And I was there for about four years. Poor man. And um, it, was, it, was, it was hell. Um, and then this girl came down from Brooklyn, like, you know. And uh, we sort of hit it off right away, and we've been together ever since. That was 26 years ago. That's great. Good for you. Yeah. So now listen, is there a website or somewhere on the web anybody can contact you yeah, or yeah, find your yeah, it's, uh, artwork? It's uh, oh, www.donaldwhite.com. Oh, Donald White Production, sorry. All right. DonaldWhiteProduction.com. You got That's it. That's it. Well, listen, thank you for coming on the show. It was a pleasure. Thank you. You'll be invited back on down the future to Donald White. Oh, as soon as I do some more, I'll do, I'll, you know. Donald White. I don't know if he knows Jack Black. <laughs> what do you think? I don't know. He knows a lot of crazy people. <laughs>